Yeah, it's yeah, the yeah, these are a little too close. Okay, now go through the door and one by one shoot him to this door. Which you wanna actually no, you that just yeah shoot him to that door. Make sure you didn't lose any. Reason why I shoot the like I do this that way it's easier just to grab them when you get to the next door. And all you gotta worry about is just moving them to the side, that way you don't accidentally pick them up while you're opening the door. I like there's a glitch in um There's a glitch in uh in uh Dead Space 2 that's similar to like the similar to this, but it's not as bad. And it's it's just a matter of exploiting the safe. Uh, save spots because I beat the game before and I used the glitch on my second run of the game on my um, old PlayStation and it was just to do the achievement where you get where you uh, use your power notes to upgrade every weapon and every and all your other items in the game. seeing this one video where this dude had a shit ton of pangs to where when he opened up the elevator they just came pouring out like it was really bad like some people were like I won't be doing that because you can see I, we got enough as it is I don't see myself getting any more than what's already here <laughs> Just trying to avoid pressing X, because if you press X, then you mess up this whole process. Yeah, no, 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 no. The fact that I can see this, and they're like right smack dab next to me. Alright, now, stay right here and grab each item and shoot it to the elevator. Be careful where you shoot them because sometimes you'll lose them. Just keep track of where each of them land and you should be fine. Once they're in the elevator and once the elevator doors open, you can literally load up on... Oh. Well, not the elevator door open. Like, when you get to where the store is, you can load up on them once you see the store. Once you see the store, you can pick them up, take them in, and you're good to go. But first you- oh yeah, but- oh yeah, wait, my bad. You have to actually walk them out first because you- there is- I didn't keep track of how many I have. And so if you're- if you don't- if you went over the limit of your inventory, some of them will remain, and just to have them, make sure you uh, keep them out of the. Uh, make sure you take them out of the elevator, because I think they disappear if you don't take them out. All right, there we go. Yeah. 
Trying to get them in a pile away from the elevator door. Also, there's a um, there's another way to get Pang, but this requires New Game Plus, where you need to have the Force Gun at max, and like you have to have his effective you have to have the effective range of the Force Gun maxed out. And in the beginning and stuff like that of the game, when you're going to the shuttle ship for the second time, you you can use the Force Gun to shoot Pang up against the. Um, and you have to be like be very careful because then you end up losing ping if you send it flying too far. Uh, you can send it, you know, up against the wall and it'll. And I've seen some people do this where they use the force gun. It will shoot up a like the side of a wall, bounce, and it will land right in front of them. So that's one way of doing one way of getting ping. But since we need to do the uh, glitch, kind of. Kind of have to. Put them over here in the corner. This process is slow. I know it is. It's a pain in the ass, but it's worth it. I was thinking really hard, like, should I do this glitch or do I should I not do this glitch while and I just said and literally it just it's just a matter of like do I need money? Yes, I need money. Is it gonna get tough at the end? Yes, it's gonna get tough at the end. You know, so I said screw it and I did what I have to. We all can't be heroes. I'm just gonna say that now. Make sure none of them are left in here. We're good. All right, now you can just pick them up. And there you go. Got a shit ton of pangs. And you just sell them. There you go. And there you go. There's your big payout. And like I said, I wasn't going to sit there and fully exploit it because you can seriously just sit there and just have a shit ton. But that wouldn't have been that wouldn't have been really fair. So only tapped into the glitch just a little bit. There you go. Thirty 
power nodes and Poetic justice, right? Not a big deal. Everything's kind of the back. To, everything's kind of like, like I'm back to being broke now. <laughs> so congratulations. All right, so move this back. I just no, why well, don't need line racks? Don't really need that. And with that, I should be Yeah, I'm set. I'm ready to go. There we go. And with that, we can do some serious upgrading to the weapons. that max we got that max and that plasma cutter has already been maxed now we should be doing stuff like this Now we're back to the way we were before. So there we go. And the reason why I created the additional save is just that way if people bitch and complain about oh how I use the how I use that random ass glitch to make a quick buck, you know, I can easily just go back and play the game and prove that I can well prove that we don't need to really do it to get past this part. I just felt more comfortable with money in my pocket to actually you know, have buy ammo, do this and that and the other for upgrading. Cause it's a pain in the ass. You can get past it no prob, like, but it, it but it's more tedious with all the shit going on. Especially on hard mode with literally no ammo at all, like how I am. And with that we can go. I'm trying to get to the end of the game as fast as possible because just in case um like something